Hey what's up guys and in this video let's talk about some upcoming Android Q features and I knew from the starting that Google is holding something back cause something was not right with the Android Q beta 1 it was not an huge upgrade as compared to Android Pie and if you're disappointed like me then you should wait for this one cause Google is working on something cool some new features that might impress you Alright, so first thing you look while using your smartphone is the lock screen and this time Google is planning to customize the lock screen a lot. They've already changed the unlock icon and there's the battery icon but this time Google is also planning to change the clock icon. It looks impressive in this one. This one I'm using is the text interface and I think it looks great. There's also some more some geometric shapes and this also looks great. All thanks to XDA, the most important feature that's coming soon is the new navigations and this time finally Google is revamping the navigation gesture guys. The back button is going back and you will be able to do all the things with this bell shaped icon that's navigation gestures. Just swipe left to go back. The best part is they are finally changing the home screen navigation. That means you won't get the recents while opening the home screen. That's what I wanted else everything is great in terms of the navigation. The third most important feature that's coming with Android Q is that you can squeeze your Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL, Pixel 3 or the Pixel 3 XL to access different different applications. Right now it's like squeeze for assistant but you can actually use this thing to open different applications. It's just like Bixby remapping. It's a fourth really cool feature is that pop-up notifications it's just like Facebook Messenger thing pop-up round shape icons and I think it looks great and actually see the contents inside that notification itself so you can access these settings and actually open the notification from this icon looks great the fifth one is really important for all the Google Pixel phones and that's dual sim support yes guys finally in future Google is going to implement the dual sim functionality what I think is the future pixel phones that pixel 4 or the pixel 4 XL are definitely going to feature the dual sim functionality so guys these are the five exciting new features that's coming in future the best part is the beta 2 is happening as early as first week of April so that's great just a few days left for the second beta and there's going to be total of six Android Q previews and you will get the final build by Q3 of 2019 I think that's gonna be October only. That's all guys. These are some exciting new features that's coming in future with Android Q. And which one excites you the most? Let me know in the below comment section about this. And don't forget to like, subscribe because that's going to really help me a lot. And peace out.